Hey guys, Mixed Media Girl here. In this video, I'm doing a simple yet gorgeous acrylic pour with a hair dryer technique. I'm using all Mixed Media Girl pouring paints. These are ready to go right out of the bottle. And here I'm using a Remington hair dryer and it has a completely cold setting and I use it on high throughout this video. My canvas is 10 by 20 inch and I started off with a white base I moved it around with a hairdryer and then I quickly torched to get rid of air bubbles so that they didn't affect my design that was going to go on top of this. Now the colors I'm using are Deep Sea, which is a dark navy blue gorgeous color. Then I've got some Peachy Coral, one of my favorites, especially with that navy blue. Then a little bit of Amethyst, which is a metallic purple. And then I used some Malibu Sky, which is a, a light uh, metallic blue, also very pretty. And lastly, I decided to throw in just a little bit of pearl pink. So not my typical color combination, but great set of colors. On the outside of my design, I added just a little bit more white so that the paint would have, uh, would flow just very easily with no issues, no stops. And then I started on one end with my hair dryer and gently pushed that paint out following all the way through to the edge of the canvas. And I kind of went in a bit of a, a crisscross, I guess, pattern. And there you go. Now you could leave it at this stage. There's a couple points that I wanted to do just a little more work on. One of them being at the bottom here. I had kind of a a nice cluster of color there that I wanted to push out and then also at this point in the middle I wanted to just expand that a little bit I'm not a huge fan of negative space so I tend to remove some of it <laughs> when doing this once I was done with that I decided to take a stick and add, a, add just a little bit more interest by pulling some of that color out into some wispies and when I do this I wipe the stick off each time so that it doesn't pull color through that I don't want and in addition to using the stick there was one spot that I wanted to blow out just a little bit you can use a straw or you know just go ahead and blow on any spot directly and you can pull the color out with a stick but you can also take some of the white and pull that back into your design if you would like so i did that in uh, just a couple spots to break up some color where i wanted to and that's about it it's pretty easy and fun you just play around with it until you are happy with it try not to overwork it and here is the up close results so these colors are all available on my website if you're interested and it's very simple yet elegant technique one of my favorites so i hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching and i will see you all next time